lighting in here. How you doing, young lady? The feeling that you're giving really drives me crazy. You don't have a play about the choke. I was at a Hey guys, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel. I don't really have anything planned in particular. There's just a couple things that I need to do. Oh, and by the way, my glasses, I apologize for the reflection. I'm like right in front of my window. But these glasses are from iBuyDirect. They're such a good price. I wish iBuyDirect would sponsor me. I've already bought two pairs of glasses from them. But I love these. These were, I want to say $30, including shipping. And the ones that I bought before were blue lights. So they were a bit more expensive. But those were, I want to say $30. 50 but still such a good price love it to be quite honest with you i don't even know what i have to do so i can check my notes okay so yeah i need to drop off poshmark packages at the post office i need to get one of my best friends a gift because her birthday's on monday and unfortunately because i'm going to be in toronto in a lab i won't be able to wish her a happy birthday that day so i'm going to just drop off a little something before i'm thinking maybe just like flowers and like a cupcake or something i need to pack Oh, and one thing I wanted to show you guys. Hey guys, I'm editing right now. So I just wanted to quickly hop in because I realized that I never told you guys what on earth I was talking about. So I essentially just ordered two crewnecks from a lady from Facebook who has her own Facebook page dedicated to children with disabilities as her son has autism and Pfeiffer syndrome. All of the proceeds go towards children with disabilities and she also holds fashion shows for them, which I think is the cutest thing ever. The pictures are adorable. She actually is has a little video about her and her family and her son Max. So her page is called Living Life to the Max. It is the cutest thing. Her son is adorable. If you have a few minutes to spare, I would highly recommend just watching it. I love the cause. I love the sweaters. Such good quality. I'm actually wearing one of them right now. This is the nurse one. I haven't taken it off for two days apart from like going to bed and then I had to go to school today so I had to change out of it. But the second I got home, I just put it back on. And then one thing I also forgot is that she was so sweet and she gifted me a little hand sanitizer holder. It's like healthcare related. It has a little button clasp to swap out your hand sanitizers with she's got tons of different styles and she can also do and for nicole but she's got tons of different patterns and it comes with a little keychain kind of thing so that you can attach it to your backpack purse your badge if you're working in a hospital whatever that may be so today because i actually had to go into school i just attached this to my backpack and it was the easiest thing super handy highly recommend this that's about all that i had to say i will link her facebook profile page down below she's low located in Burlington if any of you are interested. Okay, bye guys. The first one that I got just says Peds Nurse. It's just in this gray color. I love it. It's adorable. This is the second one in white and it just says Nurse and it's gold embroidered on there. I just think it's super cute and very simple but I really like it. So I asked her to make me those. Not too much going on but I did want to show you the sweaters. I'm thinking I'll just take you along in the car with me, listen to some songs. I will see you guys in the car once I'm on my way to the post office. Let's get some good lighting in here. So I'm just gonna head to the post office right now, drop off a couple packages and then I'm gonna go get a gift for my friend. I wanna make this as quick as possible just cause I don't really feel comfortable going around in stores, looking around shopping. So let's get on with this. Oh my God, it's bright. busy today. I mean, I guess that makes sense. It is a Saturday. Holy, it's busy. I'm at the Shoppers Drug Mart, so I'm gonna drop off my stuff and I will catch you guys in a little bit. Okay, you guys, I I'm back. I just dropped off my packages. Now I think I'm gonna head to Longo's maybe. She's not even home right now. She's at work. But I think I'm gonna just drop that off. So let's head to Longo's I think. I don't know. Hey man, great bike. You said forever now I drive alone past your street. Oh, you could have signaled, buddy. I'm 
miss Target. I haven't been to Target in I don't know how long and it's honestly kind of depressing. I used to go there all the time. It wasn't healthy because I used to go there literally all the time and spend my entire paychecks when I when I had like my very first like part-time job but it brought me so much happiness. Go. I'm a metro now. I'm gonna go in and get her flowers and maybe a cupcake or something. Not too sure. Whatever I find that is cute, then I'll get her. Okay, I am back in the car. I just went into metro. That took forever. I could not pick flowers that I liked for the life of me. I personally didn't really like any of them, so I went with roses instead, and I think they're adorable. I also got her a cupcake, so I'll just show you guys. So I got her these roses. They're just very cute. I got it wrapped up. I didn't think that they charged additional for wrapping, but they do. And then I also got her a cupcake. And I'm so excited. So I'm gonna text her, see if she's home, and then drop it off if so. I'm heading home now. I'm gonna drop off her gift in a bit just because she's at work. I am home now. Quite a bit of time has passed by after I got her flowers and a cupcake. I just did some skills review for nursing. So when I go in, I have to do IV medications, catheter insertion, aseptic technique, dressing changes, trait care, suctioning, and then I started packing. So my friend, I still have her gift. Her roses are over there with the cupcake. So I made her a card. It's like very embarrassing. I don't know. I just always make my own cards, but I ran out of cute paper. So it looks like this. And then on the inside, I'm just going to block the message, but I just put some flowers. Yes, I'm just going to wait until she answers my text just because I don't know if her parents are at home or not, but that is about all for today. I know it was like a very chill, quick vlog. Not too much going on once again, but there's not very much going on in my life. So I hope you enjoyed this quick little vlog and hopefully soon enough we'll be able to go out in the future and do fun things. But I really hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.